Okay, one more short one. Um, and, uh, well, I guess short one is the video, long one is the track. This is the double crossover that my uh, parents, uh, sorry, my in-laws, <laughs> uh, my father-in-law and my mother-in-law got this for me a couple of years ago when I was initially trying to start building a layout. And sadly, uh, I had to put things on hold for a while for a number of reasons. But uh, they got me this, which is nice because these are one of the more costly pieces to get um so they got this for me i if i recall it's either a christmas or it was a birthday gift i think it was a birthday gift but it's been a while and i i apologize mom and dad for for not remembering that um but this was uh one of the gifts they got me as a double crossover which um if you've seen the the track plan um i'm not using it for a double main line i'm actually going to be using it into my yard but the the way I, I'm planning it out, it actually has turned out to be very useful that way. So um, I put that together, uh, the plan together for it, and I looked at it and said, okay, well, I'm going to try to drive this thing with this as well. And fortunately, the uh, L298N uh, driver chip that I have handles the amperage draw for this switch just fine. Um, this is the only one that actually needs the full power. The rest of them can be run off what's called the L293D, which is a... Uh, smaller motor driver, there's actually uh, four outputs on that one, um, and it can drive, uh, you know, this regular switch is just fine, but they would have some problems with this, but this, this particular unit, uh, the one over here, the red unit, that is able to handle all of the draw necessary, because this is um, four solenoids firing at once, I guess, so it's a lot more current draw than what the other one can support, but this one seems to work just fine. So, I'm quite pleased with that, and uh, that's that's very promising as well. So I just wanted to share that as well. I thought that was kind of cool and exciting, and so next steps are going to be refining the code and, and then uh, planning for that to go onto the layout as it gets built, and then uh, right along with it will be... Uh, some of the information that'll be going into um, the signaling system I'm going to be putting together soon for um, for the layout. Anyway, there it is. Really cool stuff. All worked. No track blew up. Thank God. <laughs> All right, that's it for now.